All right, let's see this match, baby. <laughs> Uh, okay, so the reason I picked the woman is because from the short amount of time that I've played this game, I found her to be most effective yes. against the bass, against this guy. I mean, this you need you need somebody that can jump higher than this guy, because this guy jumps high, and you see the, these little freaking uh, lightning bolt things that go across the screen. If you touch one of them, you will get kill or whatever beat you will lose the round because that's what this guy does so you definitely need something that it jumps higher and uh, is <laughs> I'm focusing on the match you see what happened right there you need something that jumps higher but the reason I got that is because I dove down and the thing with this character is you can fight him a lot of different ways like he did right there, he he just went across the screen really low. Because if you get somebody else like uh, the beast, when the beast comes down, he the beast also jumps. I forgot the name of the beast. You, you guys know the beast. When it comes down, it gets hit by the lightning. If you pick kick or dive. Although they're really, really fast, all this guy has to do is just go across the screen and then they'll hit the thing. So, I found this Dr. Scholes to be the most effective. And I'm, I'm getting whooped. All this guy needs is one more win. And for some reason, I always start out slow. But see, the thing is, it depends a lot on how the character plays and who the character picks. Head shot, baby. That's it. Match point. I came back. I just got focused. I saw what he was doing. I countered that. And I almost lost. But I'm glad I picked Dr. Scholes to verse that guy. Anyway, thank you for watching. Oh, yeah. oh, no!